be a name change. It needs to be driven by the residents. A community meeting should take place. A Valley community at odds over its name. The heated debate over what to call Squaw Valley. Good evening. Thank you for joining us. I'm Stephanie Baruchian. And I'm Alex Zambalaki. And emotions running high tonight during a meeting in Squaw Valley over a proposed change to the town's name. Some say the word squaw is offensive. And recently, there's been a push on the federal and the state side to remove the word from names for towns and landmarks. But many people in Squaw Valley are opposed to that change. Our Catherine Phillips now with more. A lot of people in the town do not want to see the name changed and they were very vocal about it in the meeting. However, some fear it could be too late to keep the name. When you change the name of a community, you're changing history. How insulting for somebody else to come around a hundred years later and want to change that. Does that mean that my grandmother, when she would call me her little squawk, was telling me something negative and derogative? With the passing of California Assembly Bill 2022, dozens of small towns across California are now grappling with how to move forward with what to call their town. The bill calls for the removal of the word squaw from the names of towns, cities, and places across the state by 2025. It has yet to get signed by Governor Newsom, but many expect him to sign it soon. Fresno County Supervisor Nathan Magsig hosted Tuesday's community meeting so people in Squaw Valley could voice their concerns. If there's to be a name change, it needs to be driven by the residents. A community meeting should take place. Some of you may or may not be aware, but the city of Orange Cove was going to take up a resolution uh, basically recommending uh, a name, uh, name change for Squaw Valley. And when that was brought to my attention, um, I, I called into that particular meeting and uh, expressed my concerns to the city council and they pulled that item. He says he's going to send mailers out to the entire Squaw Valley community to ask them to fill out a form on if they want the name changed and give some options on what to rename the town to. He says if everyone votes no to removing the word squaw, he still doesn't know if they legally could keep the name as is. And while the majority of people at the meeting tonight say they didn't want to change the name, those who do say it's time to start the process. Maxig says he hopes to bring this issue and review the mailer forms in front of the Board of Supervisors on October 11th. Reporting in the studio, Catherine Phillips, KC24, Local News That Matters.